Motherwell do have a decent record here, unbeaten in their last nine visits. And they could dearly do with three points this evening. This is Jack. McGinn, Goodwillie, it's nicely done. On to Johnny Hayes, and Johnny Hayes is breaking through the defence and goes all the way to open the scoring inside three minutes. Johnny Hayes with an individual goal. It was really nice build-up from Aberdeen. One-touch stuff between McGinn and Goodwillie, and Johnny Hayes took over and sauntered through the defence. McManus had the slightest slip, and Hayes was there to take full advantage. Didn't he finish it well? Carey lines it up, and it's attacked and turned in by Paul Quinn. 11 minutes into his first start for Ross County. It's the former Motherwell man who heads Ross County in front. Tesla. He's caused problems already with that long throw, and there's Drury! And the on-loan Manchester City winger comes up with an important goal just one minute before the break. Ross County failed to clear the throw-in, and Drury arrived. Nicely done by Paul Quinn, the man who opened the scoring. That came off Kelly's head. Arkan, he's too strong for Goodwin. Teed up for Woods. And now Carey and Ross County are back in front. It's 2-1. And Graham Carey refuses to celebrate against his old team. Calmly slotted into the corner. McCausland. Tesla now. McLean looking for an instant response for St Mirren. Drury and Tesla arrives. A rare goal for the Dutchman. St Mirren have equalised. Ross County had the lead for under two minutes. Harkins with the delivery swirling in the wind. And there is Clarkson. And he has done it once more. A goal a game, four and four for David Clarkson. And that is the first goal that Hamilton Ackies have conceded for over 450 minutes of football. Cleared by Hendry. Harkins attacked it well, and it's Greg Stewart for number two. Just four minutes between the goals. Greg Stewart with his fifth of the season. Tanzi. There's Vincent alongside him instead. Lofts the ball out to David Raven. Raven, the left-footed cross. Vincent again. And Vincent's done well there. Tansy. Oh, it's a lovely ball in, and there's Watkins. And Watkins has done it again. His fourth goal of the season. But what about the cross from Greg Tansy? It was absolutely pinpoint, so difficult to defend against. And right on to the sliding boot of Marley Watkins.